this team, or is it just chasing them? Yeah, we're going to blow for the A little bit of both. You know, you, you look at people in your locker room, and when stuff is going on, you try to try to figure out what they're thinking and how they're preparing for games. And then when you go out, certain people don't perform to, to their best abilities, you figure that they wouldn't prepare for the game or they even overlook the game. It's one or two options. So, you know, it, it was a little bit of both, I think. You know, they, they were they played very hard. You know, they didn't come in here intimidated. They already played KU. They played in the big stage already, 14,000 screaming. So it, the the home factor was nothing. In it. They, they've been through it already. So you, you see what I'm saying? It was, it was like they were like, all right, we're going to take the initial hit and we're going to – well, actually, they gave the initial hit, and you know they were just ready to play. You know, so when we came out like that, we was in for a dog fight when we didn't come out with energy. Are you guys a good team right now? No, not at all. You know, it's, we have good players, we have good moments, we have we have great coaching, but then we also have bad moments where we lapse, and you know, there's two people out there playing hard, and there's three others that don't know what's going on. You know, they don't know where the ball at, they don't know what play we run in. You know. It, if you watch us play, it's moments in the game where you can see us call a set and you just see people just don't know what they're doing, like no clue. So, you know, for us to be a good team, you can't have that. You know, if you go watch North Carolina play UNC, I mean, UNC play on Michigan State right now, that's not going on. You don't see somebody on their team call a play and four people look around like what I'm supposed to do. They're all on they're all on page right now. And I'm not saying they're playing their best basketball. and We're not supposed to be playing our best basketball now, but there's no reason for us to not know what we're doing and not have any type of energy. I think we still have people in our locker room that's not buying into Frank's situation, you know, not buying into Frank's system. And it's worked for two years. And that's why when Frank tell you guys that I've matured, I bought in, you know. Freshman year, I had my struggles because one night I'd be like, all right, maybe it'll work. And the next night I'd be like, uh, I I'm not listening to him. You know, and once you buy in, like Jamar's bought in, you know, you can see the people that's bought in because those are people that, that he trusts and he plays, you know, so. Once people buy in and believe that what we're supposed to do will help each other, then, you know, we, we'll be considered a good team because we have all the talent there. It's principles, you know. It's easy to, to play any type of, any other coach's basketball style where you just, you stand behind your man and you just sit in the lane and you see the, you see the ram, you see the ball, you see your man. But when you got to actually do something, when you got to actually get through screens third and you got to actually sprint back to the middle of the key to see the ball, you know, people don't like to buy into that. You know, and and to play for Frank, you gotta buy into it. So you know, when you see people minutes decrease, decrease, and things like that happen, it's just Frank showing you that they're not buying in, and he's not gonna waste his time. And dude, you only can want so much for someone until they gotta actually want it for themselves. Like you got, I got. If if I had if Jamar had to scream at me every day, it'd be tiring for him. Mm -hmm. He only can want so much from me until I start wanting to become better. You know, so. You know, I, tr I try, but at the same time, I, I still got to go through Frank practices and get through for myself yeah. and, and, and try to worry about making sure I'm doing everything right. So, you know, I, I'm never quitting on anybody on this team, and I'm not saying that anybody on the team doesn't have a chance, but, you know, the faster that they buy in and the faster that they believe that them being up the line, even if they get back door, that I'm helping him and he's helping me, then that's, that's the faster we'll become a good team.